guys, two pounds up from my um, lowest weigh in of 216 so far, which I hit in my last video, which is okay because I hadn't been here really late last night. I'm talking quiet because it's like just before 5 a.m. Um, Ashton is still sleeping, but today we're going to do a full day of eating for my show prep. I am eight weeks and four days out, so I'm just, just over eight and a half weeks out. Um, so for breakfast, I'm going to be a little quiet, so just, just listen really good, okay? We're having an omelet, we're having pancakes. So we have four eggs, spinach, peppers, and then I'm gonna do a cup of egg whites to finish off this omelet. All right, so first meal of the day, <clears throat> we've got one cup of eggs right here. And then we've got our omelet. The omelet is a cup of spinach, uh, three or four peppers that I cut up and put in there, four eggs, and one cup of egg whites. So and then I'm just gonna put Walden Farms on my pancakes, and I'm gonna put paste salsa on my omelet. That's meal number one. At the gym, in my morning, uh, training my morning clients. My seven wasn't here, so I did actually run home really fast, and usually I put two tablespoons of peanut butter in my oatmeal, but I'm training nonstop until one from here on out, so I wasn't gonna have time to actually go home and make my oatmeal. So I just brought my oatmeal with me, and then on my break just now I went home and I had, I just weighed out, I measured out two tablespoons of peanut butter and just, ate it off of the spoon, so the only thing that I haven't filmed is that two tablespoons of peanut butter, so I hope you believe me. But, I also went and picked up a white monster, but it's freezing in here, so I'm not even gonna drink it because it's cold. <clears throat> so that was a waste, but whatever. So now I'm just re-putting back on some music, and then my next client should be here in about 10 minutes, and then I'm training from, I have an eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12, and then I'm gonna go work out, and then I have a four, five, six, seven tonight. So, gonna try my best to film. I'll be able to film my meals, but maybe not explain them too much. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I'll catch up with you guys at my next meal. I'm doing a full day of eating right now. Hey fam, y'all remember Dallas? Hi guys. Uh, I'm actually training him right now. He's, uh, are you in season right now? Spring. Yeah, yeah. Well, what? Spring ball. He's on spring ball right now. So we always, he always trains with me to make his athletic performance top notch. So, uh, so it's about 10.30 right now, eating my next meal, which is one cup of oatmeal. Like I said, I used to put my peanut butter in this, but didn't have, didn't pack it today, so I went home and had that tablespoon. And then I usually put salt and Walden Farm syrup in there too, and it's bomb as hell. So I'm gonna eat this, I'm gonna kill him. Then I got two more sessions, one more little meal, and then we'll work out. Alright fam, we got Bowen, we got Hannah motherfucking Bowen! If you guys don't, if you guys don't know who that is, go, go read the San Diego Union Tribune! Right? That's what I was saying? Yeah, yeah, right? yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She was player of the week last week. But uh, my next meal, she's my last session before I train myself. So for my last little pre-workout meal, I'm gonna have four apple cinnamon rice cakes, and then pre-workout. Yes. Unicorn Nutrition, Yaminos, Blue Frost, bomb! Use code Lexi, Kendall, Sam, Sam, Dez. I think that's it. Sarah B. Fit. That's all I can think of. Um, yeah, so I usually just sip on my BCAs during my workout and then during my cardio and then I'm gonna take GAT Nitroflex pre-workout, which I don't need to film, so I'll catch up with you guys at the gym. We got like six. That'll be a goal. Six, six to eight. 
maybe eight to the camera. And just do one, one set and done. What's going on YouTube? So started off the back workout with four sets of six to eight on the deadlifts, pulling 365 there. Went on to assisted pull-ups for four sets till failure. You guys know I suck ass at pull-ups, so I don't even want to hear it. And the band makes me like feel really off and I like it like swings me back and forth, but I try my best to stay um, straight. And then went on to cable rows, four sets, uh, 10 to 12 here, staying leaned forward just a little bit. Feel a little bit more in the lower lat tie-in area-ish, to put it in layman's term for you guys. Um, moving on from there, we did like this, this uh, ghetto rig, laying on an incline bench, lat pull-down thing that I've, I've done before, and it's been a while since I've done this, but again, this is really good. I feel this really well in the lower lat tie-in, aka the Christmas tree area, so try this one out. It is a pretty... Pretty cool movement, you know what I'm saying? And I didn't film this whole workout, didn't even film any biceps, and I'm pretty sure this is the last clip right here, which is a lat pull down. And same thing, did four sets, 12 to 15 here. This is my first back day of the week, so it's a little bit higher volume, higher repage. Hope you guys are enjoying the video. Stay tuned, we're about halfway through, and then you guys are gonna see the rest of my meals. Thank you guys for watching, and I'm gonna catch up with you guys in this next clip. All right, guys, just finished up back and biceps, and I am drinking one scoop of protein, and then I have one scoop of creatine in here, and that's pretty much it for my post-workout shake. Um, I don't, like, preach that you need a shake right after your workout. It's just something that I enjoy, and then I always have a scoop of protein in, because then on Sundays, on my rest days, I usually use my protein scoop to make protein pancakes, because it's bomb, but And that's that. All right, fam. Welcome back to the infamous kitchen angle of you on top of my microwave. I just had my shake. I took a little bit. I uh, took a quick shower, and now I'm doing my post workout little carb meal. I always have a bowl of cereal. When I do my cereal, it's always post workout. So I'm doing. You guys know I'm on my Girl Scout cookie cereal kick right now. So uh, three quarters of a cup, 28 grams is. Uh, 2.5 fat, 22 carb, 1 gram of protein, and I'm doing 2 cups total, so it's it's right around 70, I think it was 75 grams the other day when I did that, um, so I'm going to double it and then add like, I don't know, so 7 to 8 fat, 55 to 60 protein. I'm going to round up to 65 because I think, I think it's 65 grams. And then about 3 grams of fat. So I'm going to weigh this out. Perfect. And then like I told you guys, when I do my almond milk, I have the 30 calorie unsweetened silk almond milk. And then I'll just pour in however much I want. But usually I pour in just about a cup. So... I don't like a whole lot of syrup of milk, but I like enough. You know what I'm saying? So, this is my like bad, and I use bad carb source meal of the day. Some of you would say that my pancakes in the morning are, but you're wrong. There's nothing wrong. There's nothing bad about pancakes ever. Or Girl Scout cookie cereal. So, um, I'm going to eat this. And then I have to go back to work in about 40 minutes. So I bring one one meal with me because I only have four sessions tonight. So yeah, I got to do this and I got to get ready. So I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. All right, guys, just finished up with my four and my five and finished about five minutes early. 
So before my six gets here, I'm gonna heat up my next meal. I have four ounces of chicken with a cup of green beans, and then I'm doing a full pack of Uncle Ben's ready-made rice, the brown rice flavor, and then I'm going to top it with some Frank's Red Hot, because this shit is bay. Search and email restart. Zip Recruiter. Whether you're looking to fill a long hour session or twice, Zip Recruiter makes high rates simple. One click and your job is posted to over 200 job sites. Use Zip Recruiter's dashboard to easily screen and evaluate candidates and find the right hire fast. Zip Recruiter, the fastest way to hire. Now try Zip Recruiter free. Just click the banner now or go to ZipRecruiter.com slash Pandora. That's ZipRecruiter.com slash Pandora. So I just got home from training and I'm making my last one right now, I have a cup of spinach and then I have uh, like three of those bell peppers that I showed you guys earlier that I cut up and now I'm doing six ounces of lean ground beef. Boom. Perfect. And then, and then, and then, and then, I'm going to do a cup, I'm going to do a cup of egg whites and then I'm going to do two ounces of let me get my, my goose, my goose measuring cup. Everybody knows that real men drink out of pink sippy cups and have gooses as measuring cups. That goose is honestly anabolic as fuck. So I'm going to do a cup of egg whites. I gotta play like defense on this because this skillet is tilted. <laughs> okay, so you're gonna do a cup there. Then all I'm gonna do, when I do two ounces, I kind of just like eyeball it. So I just do like a little pinch. Yeah, those are like really small pieces. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do just a little bit more. Yep. Then I'll let that cook. And then I will do one. What is this? This is the, these are the yellow potatoes? No, those are like the the stupid potatoes. Then one stupid potato <laughs> in the microwave. And then I'll show you guys when I'm done with everything. Do that. And then I'm going You're to You're a role model for everyone everywhere. I'm gonna top it off with Frank's red hot. And then this will be the end of my meals for today. My current macros are this is like an like a, a guesstimate, like you know, like one to two grams off, but it's uh, 220 protein, 360 carb, and then 80 grams of fat. I made a personal preference or a personal decision to keep my fats a little bit higher on this prep and then sacrifice carbs for that. So that's my full day of eating. I might extend this video to tomorrow just so I can show you guys that like bowl of oatmeal contraption that I was talking about that I didn't make today. So I think I'll do that. So if you don't want to see that, then thanks for watching. If you do, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. Here we are making my concoction that I was telling you guys about. So, oh, we need to tear this scale one more time. 40, 35. 34, 30, 32. So I'm gonna put that in there, and the oatmeal's hot, so I'm gonna let it melt it. While that's going on, I'm gonna grab, so usually I do the sea salt, but I'm gonna do some more pink Himalayan salt. <clears throat> so, And I know this shit grinds now. So we'll go right there. You guys like my, my Batman pants? And then I'm gonna let this melt. Mix the peanut butter all around so that there's peanut butter in every single bite. And then I'm gonna take my Walden Farm syrup. And I'm gonna drizzle that bitch on there. And then mix all this up.
And then this is the meal that I usually have yesterday that I was telling you guys about that I didn't. So that is going to conclude this full day of eating. If you guys enjoyed this, let me know. Let me know what else, what other videos you guys want to see while on this prep. And yeah, so make sure you guys like, comment, share, and make sure you subscribe because we got more videos pumping out. Trying to do, trying to stay consistent with the two to three videos a week, which I have been. So make sure you guys subscribe because there are more videos coming and I'll catch up with you guys in the next video.